It's craft time. Today we're gonna make kites. <laughs> this is a fun kite that you can take right outside and fly. All you need for this craft is a piece of white paper. You're going to need some yarn or string, uh, your scissors and tape, and you're going to use something like crayons or markers to decorate it. Oh, and there's one more thing that you need, and that's a plastic grocery bag. We're going to use that to make tails for our kite. So the first thing we're gonna do is take your piece of paper and hold it long ways like this. And then we're gonna fold it right in half. Now you can open that up again and draw a black line down that crease so you can see it really well, or a dark line. I did that and then I drew the next two lines in kind of a triangle shape so it's more narrow at the top and wider at the bottom. And those are gonna be all the places that we fold. So when we fold it in half, we're then gonna fold it again along those lines. There it is, and that makes our kite shape. Now, um, we have on this side, that fold makes a kind of long uh, straight line at the back, and that makes gives it some stability. But we also need to put a stick across this way to give it more stability. So we're going to use our popsicle stick for that and we're just gonna tape it on there about a little bit more towards the top, uh, halfway up a little bit further than halfway up. And I'm just gonna take two pieces of tape, put them right on the end of the popsicle stick and tape that on. That's it. Now we're going to add a string right here and you can just tuck the string underneath the stick and then tie it on. I have one already finished over here. So it looks like this. Now I took a long piece of string as long as I could so that I could get my, let my kite fly really high and then I twined the rest of the end of the string around another stick so that can be a handle that you can hold on to. The last thing that you need for your kite is a tail and I'll show you how you're going to make the tail. Now you're going to use your plastic grocery bag and just cut off the bottom of the bag. And then you throw that part away, but then you can cut strips along the bottom of your grocery bag. And that makes a long loop. And then if you cut that loop, that makes a long strip. And if you have a colorful grocery bag, then you can get some color on your tail. Now you're gonna go uh, ahead and you can make as many tails as you want. You can have one or two or three tails for your kite. And I'm just gonna put one on this one. Well, actually I have another kite that I already decorated. So over here, I have a kite I decorated on this side with a rainbow and this side I decorated with swirls. So it would be nice and bright. I think I'm going to put my uh, swirl side out and my rainbow side facing me. And I'll just add the tail to the kite with a piece of tape. You can make a lot of these kites and have all different designs on them so that you're ready to go fly your kite. And that's it. Have a great time. Enjoy flying your kites and uh, we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.